Three ways happiness can lead to a longer life. We're all going to perish at one point or another. That pretty much is a fact. While most people will turn to science and technology to try to extend their lives, there is actually a much cheaper alternative. It's called happiness. In this video, I'm going to show you three different ways happiness can lead to a longer life. 1. You're more content when you're happy. Don't you feel like you're always chasing something in your life? Whether it be the latest gadgets, romantic interests, professional opportunities, etc., we all can't seem to stop moving and working towards something. Chasing goals and dreams is important too, but when does it all stop? When is enough actually enough? When you're happy, you'll realize that there are some things in life not worth going for. For instance, trying to get into a high-risk profession may be worth a lot of money, but it's going to have adverse effects on your health. Or you'd go after you something that you think is going to make you happy, only for you to realize in the end that it's slowly taking away your sanity. You could end up rich beyond your wildest dreams, but in exchange, you'll be cutting your life short. 2. You're more resilient. As you go through life, you encounter countless problems and challenges. If you're not careful, these challenges can quickly overpower you. However, when you're happy, you're more likely to be resilient. Where others are going to let problems consume them, happy people are more likely to let them slide. Essentially, happy people develop thick skin which allows them to respond to problems more positively than unhappy individuals. 3. You're more likely to take good care of your body. When you're happy, you tend to take good care of your body. This means you're not going to do anything that's going to cause it some harm. You're not going to abuse it by eating tons of junk food, getting drunk every single night, or stressing yourself out at work. Instead, you'll make sure you only eat healthy food, you'll exercise regularly, and you're not going to sacrifice your body for a few extra dollars on your paycheck. Remember, happiness doesn't equate to wealth. You can be happy and not have a lot of material possessions. Likewise, you can be wealthy but be deeply unhappy. It's up to you who you want to be. But if longevity matters to you, I suggest you prioritize happiness.